Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to another War Thunder First 10. This is my first 10 battles for the Type 90 main battle tank for Japan. And it is a 9.7 battle rating main battle tank. It should be pretty sweet. It's essentially a Leopard 2A4. Very similar. And we're going to endeavor to test the stock speed. And see how we do making it all the way down this uh, train line to the A point. It is the 7th of July. I have just finished grinding all night long. And... And I've got my parts set to... I mean, I've got my research set to parts. I'm a little tired. I have been playing the game all night long to uh, grind out the research for the Type 90. I don't have any research or silver line boosters. And uh, here's a look at the tank. I dropped down to 20 rounds. So that took most of the ammo out of those fuel storage bins and took all the ready ammo right out from directly behind the uh, loader. So looks like we're not as fast as an Abrams, at least. So that's good to know. We're fighting Russia and Germany, so I could potentially be fighting two A4s. Um... One thing that is new that I like is Gaijin has set up a way so that you can mirror a decal and have them both facing the same direction. Instead of this facing forward on one side and backwards on the other, they've got a setting in the uh, two-sided decal thing where you can set it to mirror each other instead of just matching up like they usually do. So that's cool. That's, a, that's an improvement. All right, that was cool. That was funny. I don't think he's gonna wait. I hope I can actually get this first capture. Oh, he went past it. No, yes he did. No, he didn't. Wait, did he? Yeah, he blew right on past the cap. Well, I'll wait for the guys coming up behind me. Because I do really don't think this is a contestable cap, particularly, so. If you guys can hurry. Oh, boy. I probably should just cap, but we'll risk it. We got a guy up north, up in the trees there, so. Boring though it might be for a moment, I'll wait and do these dudes a solid here. If they hurry, they really gotta hurry, though. Hopefully the guy in the trees up there is watching. Uh, Alright, no, well, I thought they stopped, but they didn't. You guys really need to hurry. This is a foolish thing, but come on. They're making their way here. I Ordinarily, I would not wait. But I feel bad because the dude is driving a Canarvan. Come on, man. All right, I should have abandoned ship a long time ago and captured, but I don't want to wait this long now and then capture right in front of them. That's even worse. I'm sorry, everybody. God, why would you drive those? are you doing? Oops, sorry. We've captured most of the strategic zones. Attention to the designated grid square. Okay, let's see what the reverse is like. In the snow. Tch. <laughs> Reverse seems okay. Oh, that doesn't work. We're losing everybody north of us. Oh, here comes one. Wonder if I can get a shot into him before he sees me. 
Well, boys. Oh, there's another one right there. Holy loader. Come on, come on, come on. Get up, get up, get up there. Well, we're dead. But we got two kills with our first two shots. That's not the worst debut I've ever had. I don't see any more targets anywhere. Well, we're going down with the ship, but it's been a decent decent start, I think. I don't see any more tanks. <laughs> oh my god, slowest, most dramatic death ever. Look, everything is like redded out or blacked out. Okay, here's battle two. Once we get moving, I'll do the rest of my lineup real quick. I did make slight adjustments from what I've been grinding with. Because I put the Type 90 in my Type 74 slot and moved the Type 74 over to the STB or STA2 slot. Thank goodness I'm finally done with the STA2. So I looked at the uh, x-ray on this thing and the frontal protection. Wow. It's amazing. Okay, we're just going to cap. That's fine with me. I'll take a capture. Hurry, Leo. Yeah, you made it. All right. Now what? Like they're in our spawn up north already. I mean, obviously this dude just went straight for it. What a turd. Small battle. We've captured most of the strategic zones. Come on, up the hill we go. Attention to the map. Just watch out for that idiot, guys. Okay, we're fighting America and Russia. That's probably an Abrams, I'm guessing. That sucks. Oops. Rock in the way. Didn't see it behind that little shrub there. Our victory is here. Hopefully I knocked him right out of the battle altogether. I did. That is good. I knew the gun wasn't gonna, gonna get up high enough in time to actually hit that guy that I was aiming at. I just wanted to throw dirt in front of him so he didn't get a shot at me. I couldn't actually identify what he was. So. Let's see if we can get a spot on him here. Come on, gun. Up. Up, gun. Cannon, you need to raise. Since you're not going to.
Okay, well. Let's go Cat B, I guess. Well then, that takes care of him. I don't think I'm going to get a capture on B. I don't think we're going to get a cap here. I do not believe we're going to get a capture. I believe this is going to be a uh, first survive battle though. Goodness gracious, that was a fast one. Well, we'll see you in Battle 3. Okay, here's Battle 3. Okay. Uh, I guess uh, there's not much I can really say about Battle 2, except uh, that went about as well as it could go. The uh, BT-5 that ended up being there, I couldn't tell what he was, and I was not on good terrain to risk uh, getting disabled, so I chose to just fire a shot in front of him and then re-establish. I thought he was an M56, which would have been a little bit dangerous, but not really too bad. Okay, so we're capping. It's okay. Uh, that's all the team that was coming, so it's all right. Smoke, the uh, engine smoke didn't really help. But okay. Let's go see what's coming down the back road, I guess. Okay, we're just fighting America, so I would expect there's going to be Abrams coming down the back road. Yep. I think my shot hit anything, and I think he smoked. Ah! Well, that's annoying. Reverse isn't too bad at all. looks okay for now. You're repairing too? That'd be kind of funny. Yep. Oh, grabbing a crew member. Alright, come on. Switch, 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 switch. Neutral steer, neutral steer. Trying. Oh my god! Come on! shot in the back from A. Well, we're not, but come on. God, come on. Well, that was a frustrating battle.
So I don't really know what I want to do here. So this should be hilarious. Um, I guess I'm gonna go find some place around here by A to sit and defend A. Might be a little boring, but it's a smart thing to do. Plus, without any parts, as evidenced in Battle 3, I've got to stay near a cap because, oh my god, that was annoying. So the joy of Battle 2 was short-lived. <laughs> we won. We won Battle 3, so that's okay. That's the important thing. We did win. But my goodness. Barely get the gun exposed, not even get to a stop, get hit, lose the cannon. Rosh, rinse, repeat. Oh well. I don't know if that was friendly artillery at the corner there, or if it was their artillery that they used for a smokescreen cover. Either way, it blocked me out pretty well. Kept me from being able to see those guys. So, worked for them, I guess. Ah yeah, well. At any rate, moving on. Do a slight bit of uh, Italy exploring here. Stay a little close. First, we should probably see we're fighting. Alright, Germany and Russia. Presumably, they'll come up through the city. But I really have no idea. This map is so new and I've seen it so rarely. I think what I'm going to do is pull up here. What the Bella Villa you have! We'll see if we can't catch them. Okay, there's one behind us. Is he still alive? He is still alive. Alrighty. So the answer is yes, they can they can get up here real quickly behind us, so I guess we're gonna have to be a little careful here. Man, he must have flown north, which means we certainly could have flown south, but took care of him anyway. Probably should Somehow is the Abrams the worst tank? No, it is definitely not the worst tank, man. Okay, we're still doing all right. Attention to the designated grid zone. I'm gonna stay in defense for just a minute here. I want to get back on sort of flatter ground, though. All right, let's get rid of that. Okay. Now we're in a decent position. It's a good little spot right here. I know it's boring. I don't... I prefer not to have battle maps for first tens because I play defensively at the start of the battle. But it is the best way to do it. And, well, it is the first... One of the first ten battles, so... Here it is. Our guys don't look like they're having too much trouble down south. Lost a few up north, but we're not doing too badly. Do I push down and help them at B yet? I don't know. I could, but it'd be a lot easier if I had parts. It'd be a lot easier to push down towards B and not get away from A if I already had parts researched. Attention to the map. All right, we'll move down south. Go 
go through the city. I was gonna say we'll take the fast way, but we'll go through the city. Should be a little bit more exciting than what we've had so far. The boring, the boring sitting and waiting. This this should be a uh, wow. More exciting, assuming I don't get stopped cold by little metal sidewalk posts. Alright, let's um, take a little scenic drive through the Italy map. Oh dear. That's a little bit scary. Oh no. We don't have any SPAA either. Alright, I'm not sure where we just lost our guy, but the one that they killed was all the way down south. Whoops. Yikes, that's the second kill for that 177. Not good. Not good. Trying to get down there and reinforce our guys in the south before they all get killed. That 177 is going to have another third bomb on him. There he is. My gun can't traverse high enough. Alright. I was going to take a shot at him, but... My gun can't get that high. Okay. Enemy marked on the map. At the B point. Let's see if we can come in from behind them. Do not want to knock a tree down. Bye bye, Leo. few left. Well, that's awesome. Going all the way back down, back down to or back north to the 8.3 to repair, though. Come on, turn. Well, my breach is out, and that's a problem. That's pretty. Look at that. Nice. So we'll sit here and wait for that to finish decapping. And we'll go cap. It's really irritating losing the breach. Especially to what seemed like it was shrapnel. Only a couple left. I'm a little concerned with the bomber. I haven't seen him get killed yet. Alright, we got a saber up though. That's good.
Thank goodness for the frontal armor. Thank you. That's our friendly machine gunning over there. I think it is. It seems like it's coming from him. I hope so, because all I can do is fire my machine guns, and I can't even use the roof machine gun now that I lost my commander. Ah, that's friendly. That's good. That's very good. Get in here and speed up this cap. a boy. Okay. Well, if we end up surviving every other battle, I won't be angry in this first ten. Okay. We've captured most of the strategic zones. Uh oh. <laughs> well, here's battle five. Let's hope we break the every other streak and we survive this battle too. Oh my goodness. That is a tiny battle. Okay, Germany and Russia. That's a small battle. I'm glad somebody's following me. I'm gonna go for C. Because I know a path to get there relatively quickly. Hopefully we, yeah, don't get stopped right there. So, about that very relatively quickly part. Forget it. <laughs> Still not bad, but not as quickly as it could have been. Alright. Go, baby, go. Accelerate, accelerate. Seems like it's got pretty decent power. Acceleration seems pretty good. It's getting up to a pretty decent top speed. Be nice to have smoke with it eventually. And, you know, APF SDS. It's not bad right now. Just gotta be careful with my heat FS rounds and the fences. And that. God! Ha! <laughs> of course. Well, here's Battle 6. Um. Not exactly what I wanted to see. After the first five battles, uh, after the first two battles, I thought I was going to tear it up. And then eh, it's come a little bit back down to earth since then. But it's still a very good tank. Um, not having parts is a huge negative, obviously, when it's brand new. And that's a pain in the butt. But, oh well. On the whole, it's definitely a very, very nice main battle tank. And uh, should be very, very fun. I will update at the end of the video what I think, but I'm pretty sure Japan's got a winner here. Probably an easy tie with the Leopard 2A4 for the best overall tank in the game right now, I think. So I do want to be near the cap so that I can repair if I need to, but I'm not going to be the first one to go in there this time. Friendly engine, I heard. I want to let you guys go ahead. I got a good gun, but I got no parts. Okay. Shooting. Got his gunner. Okay. Took his gunner. Got his engine on fire. Tracked him. 
That'll work. I'll take that. I'll take the assist. I was ready for another shot on him, but I'll take the assist there. Okay. Hear a lot of shooting going on. We probably knocked a couple of them. We lost a couple, but we knocked more of them out than they've knocked out of us by a little margin. All right. Let's uh, sit patiently for just a moment. We'll get to a little, little bit better spot, I think. Okay. Nobody there. Looks like they got around behind us. Marked up there. Looks like he might be on fire. Looks like he's knocked out. Okay. Whoa, smoke right there. That's a Panzer IV and my shot didn't kill him. Of course not. I don't believe it. I just... Oh, my God. Allied forces have captured a zone. Panzer IV knocked out my gun barrel. Ah, <sighs> he takes a 122 millimeter heat FS round. And then hits me right in the gun barrel. You gotta love it. Ah, oh, God, amazing. Well, so much for bothering to repair. I cannot believe it. As I get over the ridge. Our victory is near. Alright, well, we ended up pulling off the victory again, so, well enough. It's just annoying, just barely, just barely not making it over that ridge before that missile hit me in the back and set me on fire. Ah, well. Let's hope these guys spawn in quickly. Take my usual trip over to the B point, although it's a bit more dangerous without having any parts. Not having parts sucks so bad. In this case, it's been, uh, it's definitely cost me a couple times. Certainly enjoying the Type 90, however. Okay, everybody's in. All right. Uh, we can, it moves pretty quickly. It is a pretty decently mobile tank. This for sure. Okay, we got somebody coming right up close there. Oh, he's right there. All right, well, here's Battle 8. Uh, Battle 7 was the worst one so far. Uh, yeah, definitely. Seems like the French have got a decent tank. <laughs> um, so, yeah, looking forward to getting the AMX-40. My gun just just was half a second coming down low, and the terrain was just the wrong way there to get a shot at the AMX-40. I don't know that I would have stopped his gun, but, oh, well. Maybe. Maybe I would have. Maybe I would not have. I don't know. Oh, well. 
Another small battle. Very small battle. Hi, Space Cat. Um, I would love to wait for people coming, but I don't know if anybody is. Looks like my squad mate is coming up this way, so. There we go. time I get up here to help, he's going to be repaired. Yeah, whatever. Hopefully it was the artillery that damaged him. Okay, small battle. Let's, uh... Come on, come on. Awesome! Ah, oh, that's just beautiful. That's just lovely. What did my shot hit? I go, oh, no, I can't tell. Somebody want to kill him, please! I don't know what my first shot hit there. I'm assuming a stone wall, but who knows. Okay, well. Here's Battle 9. We had... Two guys go all the way to the southern edge of the map. One guy go all the way up to the north on top of that stupid hill on that map. And we just, there weren't enough players in the game to have that many people go all the way up. There were just weren't enough, there weren't enough people on the team to go all the way to the far edges of the map like that. Their team went down the middle and it was over, but whatever. I did manage to set Space Cat on fire twice with my uh, uh, Type 74 APF SDS rounds, but uh, he got saved by somebody else before I could finish him, so unfortunately. Sadly, couldn't get the third fire on him. And he had FPE, so. He survived. Come on, baby, move, move, move. Get this first cap out of the way. Some place to repair if I actually survive a hit. Attention Fairly big battle. Germany and Russia to fight. Okay, got that first cap down. I think we should relocate. Can be that's good. A couple of them gone. It's a decently sized battle. I haven't seen Italy very much at all in 1.79, so it's interesting to. <laughs> Straight behind me. Alright, well here is battle 10. 
and we will uh, go grab the ACAP real quick, and then we'll try and take it south and try to get out and use the speed a little. I probably should fight in the city here at close range and uh, urban um, knife fight brawling with this thing, but I'm going to see if I can't get up out that way. Might be the wrong decision, but... Okay, I guess I'm just going in then. Lovely. Ooh, we playing. Okay. World War II matchmaking. Alright, let's go. Let's get out of here before the artillery hits and sets us on fire. You go first. Because I don't want to get hit in the side. Looks like we got somebody out here. Wait for the smoke to clear. Well, I was going to go south, but we have four people going south, so I'm going to go back into the city now. We got too many people south. Okay. There's one. I knew there had to be one up there. There's his gun barrel. I see it. All right, he's smoking again. Let's go and see if we can engage these guys off to the right. Our guys should have their attention. Just saw that guy go back there. We're holding two points. We're okay. Did our guy just... Yep, we just lost our guy there. down. Good. So far, so good. I'm waiting for this T-64 to show himself. Ah. I have to third person aim. gonna hold steady here. Somebody's right back there still, I think. Yep, he is. Okay. Okay. Please don't be a bomb on me! Has to be the breach. It's just it's world's the cannon. It's just gotta be. Attention to the map. All my cover is gone. Attention to the designated grid square. Let's get out of here. Somebody attack him. We didn't lose any crew members. Okay, back to A to repair the gun. How annoying. Bye bye. Well, that's annoying. I was ready to move in and fight these guys, but uh, yeah. Now we have to wait for the gun barrel to repair. For what, the third, fourth time? So the guy who damaged me was friendly. The guy who did, no wonder, I, I'm looking for his name over here. No wonder, he was friendly.
What a dipshit. That explains why I couldn't find him on the enemy team. I'm sitting there looking for his name like... That was no accidental bomb. T-64 is still alive over here. Where the hell is he? He is still alive in here. I'm not sure where he was when I drove past, but... That'll do. That'll do. Happy to get a kill in Battle 10. Very nice. Let's see if we can get that last cap again, too. It would also be nice. Friendly plane. A little bit of GPU pickup in going on here. Can we get in that last cap? Yeah, I think so. Oh my god! Thank you. Thank you. Well, at least I... Oh, he's repairing too. Okay, I thought he was helping me repair, but that's alright. It's totally okay that he's... There we go. Now we did. Not going any farther forward than the uh, cap, though. Got a 23-4 up there somewhere, and a uh, some kind of main tank that damaged my gun breach again. Probably that T-64B, and there went the T the ZSU 23-4 again as well. Okay, one dude left. Two caps and a kill with no parts or FP or anything. I'll take it. I wonder where that 906 was. I missed it on the minimap. Nobody's saying anything, so... Attention to the map. There we go. Keep it up and will be oh, let's go find him. Okay. He's dead. Nice bomb. There, Henry. Keep our eyes open for any enemy aircraft coming. Because he did respawn. Would not be surprised to see an airplane. Yep. See him. Probably coming in low. He's coming in at all. Ah, there he is. Way too high for me to get a shot at him. That's too bad. Oh, that was our dead teammate, I think. Oh, there he is. He's way too far for me to get actual hits on him, but we'll keep shooting at him just the same. I can't get my main gun anywhere near high enough to shoot at this guy. Oh, they got him. Nice shooting, A7M1. Okay, well, we'll just uh, save the final thoughts for the end battle results screen. I'm not even going to bother trying to get them done now. <laughs>
<laughs> that was awesome. What a perfect finish. That was beautiful. I love it. What a great end cap for the 10th battle. Okay. So, final thoughts for the Type 90 Japanese 9.7 battle rating main battle tank. Yeah, it's really good. Um, not having parts is obviously a huge source of frustration at the beginning here. I wouldn't be mad at you guys if you just bought parts right from the start and just went from there. That would be totally okay. I would uh, not look down on anyone for doing so. And in fact, for either tracks or uh, horizontal turret drive as well, so you could get to FPE and buy them because it's so frustrating at high tiers to get knocked out that way. Um, the default heat FS round is acceptable, it's serviceable, it's not great. You're probably going to need a lot of multiple shots to kill people. I did have at least one, two, three, I think three. Two for sure, probably three one-shot kills with it, so... Not too bad. Um, it's got a huge burn through and you can definitely take out a lot of crew with it. But I would expect um, a lot of the armor you're going to face at this high of a battle rating. Either it's going to have ERA on it that's going to stop it. Or you're going to hit the side in a side skirt and you're going to be lucky to burn through the tracks. So it's not a bad thing. But uh, the heat or the APF SDS will obviously be a tremendous upgrade for this. Just like it is for every tank that doesn't have APF SDS and then gets it later. Or gets better APF SDS like the Abrams. Um, mobility seemed really good. The armor is pretty good. Uh, I kept surviving hits to the front of my tank. I was losing the breach, but I wasn't losing any crew members. So there is a, you know, a plus side to the fact that I kept losing the breach and not just getting outright destroyed. It was really annoying, but it was better to be annoyed and be able to drive back to the cap and repair than to just be detonated and lose all your crew. So for what it's worth. The reverse is pretty good. The um, turning seemed all right. It seemed maybe a little better than the Leopard 2A4, but honestly, I would probably have to drive it a little more to be sure of that. Um, very, very similar to the Leopard 2A4 in almost every respect, um, right down to the ammo, of course, except it gets slightly different ammo than the 2A4 does, so that's a funny part of the game. Um... I think that'll do. I can't really think of too much more else to say. Uh, I guess the big thing that it doesn't have is the cannon on top, but neither does the Leopard 2A4. So that's a nice little uh, advantage that the KPZs and MBT-70s and the uh, 2A4 and such have. But while it's nice because you can absolutely decimate, anti or decimate aircraft coming in, it's not really a necessity. I mean, it certainly helps. But other than that, there's a whole bunch of bonus footage coming up after this, so stick around for that. It's uh, various different things that have happened while I've been playing Japan over the past few months of just playing and grinding. So enjoy that, and I look forward to bringing you guys more War Thunder battles very soon, and we'll see you next time. Thank you all very much for stopping by and checking this one out. Enjoy the bonus footage, and have a great day, everyone.